Hello, I'm Uday, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Sydney. Today, I'm going to walk you through how you can create an AWS file storage gateway using Amazon EC2 as the host platform. Let's get started. First, sign in to AWS Management Console. Then, choose Services and select Storage Gateway. From the Storage Gateway Console, choose Create Gateway. Please note, if you have no existing gateways in the AWS region, choose Get Started to be routed to the Create Gateway Wizard page. For Select Gateway Type, choose File Gateway, then choose Next. For Select Host Platform, choose Amazon EC2, then choose Launch Instance you are redirected to the EC2 console. In the Amazon EC2 console, configure the EC2 instance as a host for the file gateway. On choose an instance type, choose the M5XLARS instance type. On the configure instance details space, choose a value for auto-assign public IP. If your instance will be accessible from the public internet, Verify that auto-assign public IP is set to enable. If your instance won't be accessible from the internet, select auto-assign public IP to disable. On add storage, choose add new volume to create a local disk for case. Minimum requirement size is 150 gigabytes. Optionally, on add tags, you can tag your instance. On Configure Security Group, add rules to allow clients to connect to your instance. Minimally, this includes TCP 2049 for NFS client. You will also need port 80 inbound from your browser. Continue to review and then launch your instance. Click Instance ID to view instance details. Note the IP address of new instance. Now navigate back to AWS Storage Gateway Console and click Next. When choosing a service endpoint, you can choose Public, FIPS, or VPC. For the purpose of this demonstration, we'll use Public. Type the IP address of your Gateway Virtual Machine. Your web browser must be able to connect to this IP address. The IP address does not need to be accessible from outside your network. Choose Connect to Gateway. Review details and fill in the gateway name. Choose Activate Gateway. On Configure Local Disks, you will see the secondary stories that you created earlier while creating Stories Gateway instance. Leave defaults to create a case using secondary volume. If you receive storage gateway related error, confirm that storage capacity size meets the minimum volume size requirement. Choose Configure Logging. In the Gateway Health Log Group wizard, choose the Create New Log Group option. Then choose Save and Continue. You will now be greeted with successfully created gateway messes. To create file share, Click File Shares from left navigation menu, then click Create File Share button. Provide an Amazon S3 bucket name, file share name, type, and then choose Gateway created earlier from drop down list. Finally, finish the file share creation. File Gateway supports both NFS and SMB. For this demonstration, we'll choose NFS. Now, from the client instance, try to mount the storage gateway that you created. So now you know how you can create an AWS file storage gateway using Amazon EC2 as host platform and mount it to client instance. Thank you for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.